Hello and welcome to today's daily devotional from Orangefield Presbyterian Church. My name's Ruth McConnell and today we are reading from James chapter 2 verses 14 to 18. Let's read God's word together. Faith and Deeds What good is it, my brothers and sisters, if someone claims to have faith but has no deeds? Can such faith save them? Suppose a brother or sister is without clothes and daily food. If one of you says to them, go in peace, keep warm and well fed, but does nothing about their physical needs, what good is it? In the same way, faith by itself, if it is not accompanied by action, is dead. But someone will say, you have faith, I have deeds. Show me your faith without deeds, and I will show you my faith by my deeds. Let's pray. Almighty God, our loving Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for your mercies to us, which are new every morning. Great is your faithfulness. Lord, we thank you so much that you have been with us every day of this global pandemic, that you have been merciful to us as a people of God, as a church and a community. And we thank you for that, Lord, and we want to give you glory for it. Lord, thank you that we are a people of hope and we pray that we will live that out loud to our families, our friends, our neighbours and colleagues, Lord, and that we will believe that we have hope and a future and live as if we believe it. We thank you for today's passage, Lord, that reminds us that faith without works is dead. May each of us have a living faith that is lived out in the belief that there is abundant life for all who believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. Lord, may we live that every day of our lives. Help us each one, Lord, to find a space each day to read our Bibles, to sit quietly before you and listen to what you might have to say to us through your word at this time. Help us, Lord, to keep going, to keep going in the faith, to keep reading our Bibles, to keep praying and remaining and abiding close to you. And we pray it all in Jesus' name. Amen. Thanks, everyone. Have a wonderful day. Bye.